Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Shari. I know what time it is. Hit the like button, turn your notification on, and subscribe to the channel because I promise you, you will not be disappointed. Follow me at all platforms at Shars Reality Number Six. If you already follow my backup page, go to follow me at Shars World Number Six. Hello and Lottie Dottie to everybody, flip floppers, newcomers, and day ones. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Everything on this channel is a legend, in my opinion. Let's jump right into it. Let's jump right into it. Ain't nobody sleep with y'all last night. Let's go. So listen, let's have a conversation, right? Ken seems to have flipped the script and he did that in less than 24 hours, okay? Now, I'm a person that look at a person and be like, oh, they seem like a nice guy, but I understand that presentation is everything, right? And looks can be deceptive at some times, right? So Ken looks like a sweet guy, but oftentimes when you don't heal, you kind of pick up the same kind of person, Um that you had before just a different shade so I'm not so convinced and was not and has not been convinced that Ken don't have some of those same traits that her husband um, or Martel may have had which probably drew her to him okay with that being said a lot of his interview with Carlos and Dr. Heavenly confirmed that for me okay um, he didn't First of all, he told way too much, okay? She didn't even come on and say X, Y, and Z happened. We got into it because of what? She kept it very... Um, very minimum uh, We just had a disagreement Which would have been the right route to say But as soon as he got the mic in his hand It's kind of like he was like let's go Right you told too much Y'all had a disagreement You told how it happened Why it happened When it happened Then you threw her under the bus And said that she felt and communicated Which we've all known that Or have saw that about her But like I think you told too much I think you, you give a little sucker vibes Okay Now this is just based off this interview So you're going to have to come back And show me something different um, and then you kept mentioning things like, you know, when I tell you something, okay, dude, you're not her daddy, right? Um, it's one thing when I ask you to say, you know, do something that's different, but you saying when I told you something, what do you mean when you told her something? Dude, she a grown woman. I don't even like the way you presented that, okay? To each his own though. If she like it, I love it. Um, so this is what he had to say during the interview and then how he flipped the script today because the real him done showed up, okay? Um, this didn't just happen because folks making him mad if it's not in you it ain't gonna show up something that's not in you don't visit you okay it only visits you when it's there it's familiar it knows where you live at so stop playing with all this he's a nice guy because i'm I, 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 i'm not buying it okay so he says that trisha is a bad communicator uh he don't she don't wants to be held accountable and he also says that you know he doesn't like the internet okay he doesn't watch the show he really don't even really try to listen to the comment section okay cap because we later found out you're a liar all right he says when he tell her something uh and trisha tries to make it uh be about something else you know basically that's irritating he's very uh clear about what he expect from her and basically when she does the opposite or refuse to listen to what he want her to digest that's when all hell break loose okay um he says that it wasn't about marty martin it wasn't about her husband it was just about her and his relationship um and the communication that they failed to communicate about okay um he says that it wasn't about no comments you know he definitely was not you know intrigued or you know feeling violated by the comments because he can care less okay um he says that you know he wouldn't even bring it's not even as serious for him to bring her husband or you know the comment section or Marty Moore home with him it's never that serious okay and, and like I said he's just his whole demeanor was like very forceful very like do what the hell I say even though he did it a little milder than we know Martell to be bold but he definitely did pull a Marty Moore and I don't care how you slice and dice that thing okay um he says as her man right he's not saying that she don't know but you know basically he been around the world a little bit more than her okay um therefore he's trying to tell her that there's a better way to do things okay um and at the same breath of him saying that it was not about Marty Moore uh he he also said that it was about Marty Mar. okay? He asked her, what was that about, okay? Why did you do this, right? Why did it present itself like this? Um, and basically, he was saying that 
you know, because it's coming off as a deception, right? Um, and it's looking like she's lying, even to him. So you said it wasn't about Marty Moore, and you really wasn't that pressed up on it, but then you admitted that it was about him in so many words, okay? But listen, you're talking in circles, not me, all right? He says that she don't understand that he's telling her for these reasons because there's a better way, okay? Um, he says that Trisha believes that questions mean that um, it's accusations, right? Um, and really he just want her to be clear of what she's saying um, so he don't have to assume right uh, that's a good point I'll give him that one um, but you know even when he was talking about um, left the house for a couple of days and went to the hotel baby you better learn you talk about she don't like accountability you don't seem that you like to hear a difference of opinion okay you don't like to dis uh, agree to disagree I wish my man would pick up and leave for a couple of days. What are, what are we doing? Um, I'm not operating like that, right? I have learned in these 37 years of my life to have a conversation, whether we like what we said to one another or not. You're going to sit right here. You're not booking a hotel, but listen to each his own. That was super weird, right? But she must have so much disagreed with him and put him in a place where he was like, if you ain't going to listen to me, watch, watch, baby. I've been there and I've done that, baby. You, you, you give me that type, right? Right. And you guys remember when he first came on, he was kind of like less buff. But now since all these women are like jumping in his comment section on the thirsty side or jumping in his DM like you deserve better, baby, Kim. Now he's taking that to his head. OK. Um, and now he's over there like, oh, if I deserve better then you know, I'm going to get my body right. He and got his body, you know, together, together. He looking a little snatch and it's going through his head because here's the thing. People are jumping in his inboxes, not knowing the real him y'all don't know him y'all know him from what he present himself as and you guys know him as what he's giving us but you guys don't know what Trisha has to endure okay or what he has to put her through or what she has to put him through right so I think y'all jumping a gun a little bit with thinking he's not that dude and let me tell you how I know that y'all jumped the gun a little bit just by his presentation real men is not going to go back and forth in the comment section calling people ugly um you know, y'all miserable, y'all this, y'all that. I thought you was impressed. I thought you don't watch the show. I thought you can care less about the comment section. But the words that you, that splurred out your mouth, once people started talking, like I said, the real you showed up, okay? So all that you a good man and you could do better, y'all let that, he let that go to his head. Um, and not only that, he couldn't even refrain from being the jerk that he presented himself to be doing that interview. Um, to me at least um, because he was so eager to show y'all gonna stop playing with me uh, push his weight around on people right calling them names and stuff like that am I saying that the comment section isn't brutal no I know the comment section is brutal I know the comment section will chew you up and spit you out right but what I'm saying is you could say y'all believe whatever y'all want the name calling and all that that's something that's in you whether they pressed up on you or not it's weird right Um. so like I said here's what he had to say let's listen he says I ain't gonna lie all this TV stuff making me realize how miserable people really are in 2024 y'all got to do better y'all really too old for this sh I still love y'all though now that wasn't too bad it was the comment section that got really brutal and ignorant um, and too much for me right uh, are you pressed or are you not right be honest with yourself like if they get under your skin say that however you can address something without being being nasty and ignorant and um and, and you know disgusting and I just think a lot of things that came out your mouth thereafter was not so pleasant okay um to each his own y'all meet me in the comment section let me know what you guys think about Ken flipping the script okay uh I definitely see that this was something that was in him and it just you know, it was birth, right? Uh, you know how they say, if you sit around somebody long enough, the real them will come out. Well, we just experienced that. Uh, I don't think that Trisha is a perfect being, but nor do I think that Ken is. I think that uh, she picked the same kind of dude, just a different shade. Um, and part of that comes from her not properly healing. And you're not even divorced, okay? So you don't took a big baggage of mess into a new relationship and then created more new mess, right? Child, I can't take it serious. But listen, y'all meet me in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think about it uh, remember checkmates i love you and don't you let nobody tell you nothing different until next time bye